Hi and welcome to another video of SpaceX Update. NASA had scrubbed the wet dress rehearsal, at least for the day, for its SLS rocket standing tall at the Launch Complex 39B for its upcoming Artemis 1 mission. NASA notified that there was a pressure issue caused by both the fans on the Mobile Launch Tower. Before the test was scrubbed by NASA, the countdown test was proceeding with no issues. Engineers were testing the closeouts of umbilical arms and flame deflectors. As the time approached for filling the tanks with cryo, NASA encountered a problem with the fans and immediately decided to scrub the test for the day and take 24 hours to fix the issue. NASA spent over a billion dollar on this mobile launch tower, and it took more than a decade to build and I hope it wouldn't be much of a bigger issue like Starliner's valves issue. Today's test scrub will occupy the pad for one more day for the SLS testing, if everything goes right while fixing the issue. Or else, it will raise a huge doubt about the on-time liftoff of SpaceX's Axiom-1 mission on Wednesday. Axiom-1 was supposed to be launched on April 3rd from pad 39A, but due to SLS's testing, it is currently scheduled for April 6 launch. Elon Musk loves to do things big. A giant party bringing together some 15,000 people who have received an invitation from Tesla is ready to party on the Tesla Giga Texas site. Nicknamed Cyber Rodeo, this party, which is inspired by what Tesla had done in Berlin in Germany last year, is a marketing campaign for Tesla that does not spend a penny on advertising campaigns. Replying to a tweet from a cybersecurity firm based in Austin called Praetorian Labs, instead of saying if he was going to send them tickets, Musk rather raised expectations around this party. This might be gearing up to be literally the biggest party on earth, Musk responded. If any of you got the ticket, comment down below, how excited are you for this super hyped party? That's it for now. If you like the content of this channel, please consider subscribing 